Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How is the Department of Homeland Security funded? Roll up your sleeves, folks. We're diving into the financial world of the Department of Homeland Security, DHS. This powerhouse of safety doesn't run on thank yous and high fives. So, where does the cash come from? The DHS, a beacon of security, gets its funding through a process that starts with a budget proposal. Each fiscal year, the DHS submits its financial needs to the president. Think of it as writing a wish list for your birthday, but with a lot more zeros. The president then incorporates this into the overall federal budget proposal. This proposal is like a pie, and the DHS is asking for its slice. Next, it's time for Congress to put on their aprons and get baking. They review the budget, make changes, and must approve the funds. It's a bit like haggling at a yard sale, but with billions of dollars. Once Congress gives the green light, the dough is rolled out. The funding is allocated through appropriations bills. These are like those fancy checks your grandma gives you for special occasions. The DHS budget covers many slices of the security pie. Border protection, cybersecurity, and emergency response are just a few. Each area gets a portion of the funds to keep us safe and sound. But wait, there's more. The DHS funding also involves grants and cooperative agreements. These are like monetary high fives to state and local governments, helping them bolster their own security efforts. In essence, the DHS funding is a complex dance of proposals, approvals and allocations. And at the end of the day, it ensures that the DHS can protect the land of the free and the home of the brave. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.